Herr Morgan! Herr Morgan! Mr. Strauss? You busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Loaning. Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. I just miss him so much. Of course you do. It goes without saying. Oh, what am I gonna do? You're gonna suffer. <laughs> and life's gonna go on. That's the truth of it. I, I won't lie to you. Oh, Miss Roberts. I know. Where, where am I gonna go? Stay here with us. Dear. Folk, they ain't so bad. It's nasty out there on your own. Dear. I know. You'll be safe here. <laughs> At least for now. Till you're back on your feet properly. Thank you. Of course. Is there somewhere we can take her? I don't think she has anyone. You can stay with us as long as you want. Thank you. It's the least we can do. Mr. Morgan, I've noticed you've stopped paying into the box. I've been sort of busy, Miss Grimshaw. Mm. Well, we all need to eat, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Good morning. Hi, Molly. Feel myself. Been out a lot. Sure. Anything fun? I've been bad. I've seen all these people who needed help and I just ignored them. That's it. Well, also killed a bunch of innocent folk. I don't know why. What's wrong with you, Arthur? I just get so angry about everything, about how this is gonna end. Well, it'll only end well if you keep your mind, Arthur. We need you. I know. You seem chipper. Well, where there's life, there's hope, my friend. And? We've been thinking about our problem all wrong. All wrong. That's all. Meaning? All in good time, my friend. All in good time.
good time. <laughs> Always the show, man. Arthur? There That's she so is. Good. Can anybody spare me a bite? Please don't hurt me. Kieran. Come on. Give me that again. I thought you were insulting me. How are you, Jack? Here you was sick? A little bit, but Uncle Hosea gave me some medicine. Okay, good. They're getting hungry, Mr. Morgan. Who is? The people you haven't fed. Me? When did that become my job? Others are pulling their weight. Oh, give it a rest, will you? Molly! Hi there. Always good to see you. I'm mighty glad to be out of that cold, Mr. Morgan. Me too. Oh, I am getting too old for this gallivant. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Well, that's...
That's exactly what I've been looking for. Well, hey there, partner. Come take a look at this. Look at this, my friend. Tobacco. Nature's gift to us all. Focuses the mind like nothing else. Whatever you say. Well, I say, why buy it off the shelves when you can make your own? Well, plenty left here if you're interested. I'd best keep moving. Well, shit. Thanks, I guess. Let's go, girl. Knock, knock, Mr. Robo. No, przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. Do you borrow from a German man? Aha, uh, German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the nah, Kaiserreich. I don't speak German neither. I'm here for money, money that you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, Leopold Strauss. Uh huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, oh no, no, yeah, yeah. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu, znajdę ci pieniądze. Oh, still don't understand you. God damn it, you have a debt to Herr Strauss. Pay up. Stop! Już nie mam siły. No! No, no, nie! Już nie mam siły. A no, 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 no. Please no. No have money, but but I have this. It's good. It's good. It's valuable. It's it's Warsaw, yes. I have your things. Okay? I have Anything in here or out there? Yes. Longer I look, the madder I get. Don't even speak English. Very valuable, good? Not good yet. What you got behind there? So, uh, surprise, I mean, you know, move aside. Better be something somewhere. Just like I'm not going to fight you. 
from all kinds of dust. What do we have here? My old bronzka, yeah. Just keep quiet. I need, I must eat, Brozo. Okay, that should about cover things. Zabrałeś już prymitywie, idź precz. Ale jestem zrujnowany, zrujnowany. Need a hand with your horse? Hey, why not? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Whoa, whoa. Easy. Easy. Easy.
Just don't get no blood on my boots, mister. Lockbox. We don't got the key. Crap! <laughs> Mister, I don't hardly know what to say. Thanks, I guess. You done me a service. Hey, look, the stage company's gonna write this off as a robbery anyway. If you can get in that lockbox, you can take what you want from it. It ain't stealing if it's already stolen. Got that right. Word of advice? You see anyone might could be in O'Driscoll, head the other way. Easy, easy.
That should do us. All right, girl. You know, these hides and furs can also be done up into coats and boots and such. Beyond my skills, but there's a trapper that travels around these parts, Canadian feller, Skill Tanner. He can make just about anything. You should drop in on him sometime. Evening. Evening, Arthur. Hey, Arthur! What you want? Man, you one sour son of a bitch, ain't you? Only when I see you. Oh, only when I see you. Oh, hi, Butch. Miss O'Shea. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Called in on the small holder, Robo. Didn't even speak English. <laughs> good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's a pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. You chick? I was told I could find a Chick Matthews up here. Chick Matthews? Mm, you might want to talk to that fella over there. Now nah, I'm just here to work for the season. You Chick Matthews? Oh, no, no, not me, sir. Uh, uh, that's the green horn over there. And there it goes. So long, long shark. <laughs> Damn it! I 
right. Get back here. You owe us money. Yeah. You <laughs> So long, long shark. <laughs> Damn it! Hey! Get back here! You owe us money! Yeah! Untie me, and I'll tell you where it is. You're no place to bargain, boy. Just untie me, I'll tell you. Okay, okay. There's a map. It's in my pocket. A map? Why can't none of you fools just pay? <laughs> just take the map, okay? It's right there in my pocket. <laughs> Treasure hunt? You're lucky I ain't taking your teeth as well. There ain't no reason to tie me like this. Well, aren't you gonna untie me? You got the map. Do the decent thing. Let's go.
Why is it always gotta be such a goddamn performance with you? Now, I told you I'd get you the money next week, and I'll get it. If you didn't make it this week, who's to say you'll make it next? Don't you take that tone with me. I thought you said you loved I me. I do. I do. But what I get paid ain't enough for one person, let alone two. Your money's got to be your problem now. The only problem I got is this bleating going on in my ear. Now lay off it, Lily. God damn it. Lily. Where's our money? What? That loan you took. It's payday. I'm sorry. I don't have it right now. Well, then. I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper, give him what you've got. I ain't giving him nothing except a lesson in damn murder. Son of a bitch. something on him, I swear. He's got money on him. He, he has to. Please, hey, just you know what I see. Do please? He can't oh, spend all that this. money yet. Maybe you should think about the kinds of men you're friendly with, miss. You've got your money. I don't have to listen to your wisdom, all right? So long. Friends. I'll see what I My can legs do. are numb. Please hurry. <clears throat> oh, <gasps> yes. Yes. Just lift as hard as you can. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You saved sure. me. Oh, that was bad. Okay. Sure. Uh, I could have been stuck here and starved or eaten. Oh, you poor. Dumb animal. Oh. What'll I tell Mildred? Well, thank you. You need a ride home, ma'am? Oh. Oh, yes, mister, please. Thank you. Do you know Valentine? I live there. No problem. travel this far alone, you know. I was off inquiring about a possible new line of work. I I'd borrowed a friend's horse for the trip. See, my husband... Well, it's just me and my boy now, and it's hard to find work. Mm, I'm sure it is. A good opportunity. That's what I'm looking for. Not much work for a woman with a boy to raise. I won't work in no saloon, but I've got sharp eyes and quick hands. I was hoping to get a job working as a seamstress. A wealthy man said he'd pay me for the work. Sounds promising. Also doesn't sound real. Oh, you may be right, I suppose. He said he'd provide room and board for me and for my child. He wanted to meet me first. I'd be careful with offers like that, ma'am. I can't afford to dismiss offers like these, even if they do seem... odd. Just be careful is all I'm saying. I may not have another opportunity like this. Now I'll have to pay Mildred back for her horse. 
It sure sounds like you're in a hard position. You finding me is the only good thing that's happened to me in a long while, sir. Hey, mister. Oh, God. Good evening. We're close now. Just a little further. Thank you for all your help. You're a good man. Glad I was able to help. You take care. Appreciate it. You be well. Ma'am, will you be all right from here? I'll find my way. Thank you, sir. Well, fine then. Hey, you're okay, girl. Mr. Thomas Downs? Yep, that's me. You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... We ain't a charity, Mr. Downs. Oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm... I'll... Really? Threaten me, would you? Oh, please. I have a family, sir. Please. I don't care about your family. You have to be more reasonable. Why'd it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir, I didn't want this either. I wouldn't pay it up if it'd been a little easier. Pay the money, you'll make this stop. <sighs> 
You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife, or your family, or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <coughs> Thomas! What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman? My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. <laughs> 